Okay, so we're checking out the only game where being a dick, pissing off your parents, and getting kicked out of your house as a child just means that you get to become the hobo master earlier in life. It's change, a homeless survival experience. We're Super Saiyan hobos, damn it. This game really loves to slap you in the face, so I'm gonna pick a female, because women and children sometimes get slapped in the face less in the, in the game. That sounded bad. You know what I mean. I was never a great kid. Eventually, my parents just snapped. What do I do now? The choice is obvious. Natty Light and beating down other hobos to become the ruler. Now what? You beg from every single person you can. So winning in this game is a lot like you would expect. It tries to entice you with side quests, but the best way is to just be a dick. Beg from everyone you can. And every time you see Conan the librarian, sit in her library as long as humanly possible. See that? Just got a sandwich. Pizza crusts? Sure. Everyone always knows to check the payphone for change. Welcome to the homeless shelter, where because I'm a young girl, I'll probably get punched in the face and have my stuff taken from me. But you know what? You gotta start in hobohood somewhere. There is a lingering smell of urine and body odor. I mean, I didn't get stabbed. This is a good day. Street savvy or haggler? Street savvy. Size up. See what people might give you cash. It's like Spidey Sense, but for begging. <laughs> Strong stomach, because I know I'm gonna end up eating out of a trash can for most of my life. Librarian lady. So the entire purpose of the game is to become king of the universe as a bum and not die. Ah. Uh... The fact that this is called work ethics pains me so. But it says more money, so we're doing it. You lay down hunched over with your hands on your stomach. No matter how desperate you get, you vow never to eat bad food again. Oh, we're eating bad food again. I want to become the best dumpster diver there is. Well, we've got a shelter nearby, so I guess I'm picking sheltered. Even though the benches do seem very comfortable. Three payphones in a row. What the hell's going on here? New perk. Desperation. Stealthy. Or thief. I'm just getting caught on purpose so I can level up my crime skill. Thief. See, this our trash skill is getting strong. Something called Morsel Master is pretty amazing. Actually, having the scruffy beard as like a 13 year old girl would be amazing too. You found a whole sausage roll. It's like getting the holy grail. We got a strong stomach, we'll be fine. Never mind. <laughs> no curfew for shelter. Thank you, Jesus, considering how many I've already missed them. All right, everyone, go ahead and just uh, avert your eyes for just a minute. I need whatever's in this car. Never mind, I need to go to jail. I got arrested so many times, I got thrown into a new city. This one's way better, though. There's tons more stuff, and there's two shelters right next to one another. The last town was for plebs. This one's way better. This has a shelter with a soup kitchen right next to a place where you can get a job as an assistant manager. Right Right next to a washroom, right next to a recycling place. It's like heaven, only with a lot more urine. Winter has come, we're screwed. It's that time of the month, your period has started. I didn't know that was a thing in this game. It's time for the all you can beg fest, otherwise known as the subway. It's like doing a scratch off game, except 99% of the time you lose. And hey, don't mind me everyone, just starving to death over here. Just got three and a half bucks, which is good because I'm running out of everything else. I legitimately have no idea how I'm gonna survive this gameplay. I just fell asleep outside. Slightly reduces all happiness effects from night events. It's probably a good idea to get this. No joke, I'm getting my ass kicked so far. This bird is like, you're gonna be dead by tomorrow, man. 40% chance at stealing plain bread? Sure. Nice. This is literally the only reason I'm about to stay alive right now. I'm gonna take Survivor just because I'm always so hungry. Maybe if I find enough beer, I can get my happiness up. Dumpster diver. Better items found in trash. Apps of freaking lootly. Hey, period away. 29% steal. Shit. Got a new perk though. Someone just caressed my leg. Time to beat that ass. Please kick me out of this city. My begging is starting to go through the roof. It's taken a while, but because I got the recycling chain of perks done, I feel much better every time I give a bunch of it in. Increased speed when breaking into cars, hell yes. Hey, young Donald Trump, could I get some- Really? A couple of lucky events and people not trying to molest me in my friggin' sleep is finally getting my happiness up. I can actually afford the premium wash today. Every time I eat out of this friggin' trash can, it's like playing the lottery. Only if I pick the wrong numbers, I have to projectile vomit over everyone. No projectile- Nope, totally projectile vomiting. Get a random piece of clothing if you rest here. I should have gotten kicked out by the police long ago. I would like your finest bed bugs, please. Slowly getting my intelligence up. This is the only time in a game I wish I would have stayed in friggin' school. Hi everyone, my KD ratio on begging isn't good enough yet. Can I get some help, please? Steal a snack bar, buy a toothbrush. Beggy sense works again. After pulling the scruffy blankets of your bed over you, you fall asleep, you hear some weeping, your eyes open to remove the stained mattress and pine boards of the bed above you. This is how you get shanked, by getting into other people's business. Never mind, it was a drunk guy, we got a free beer out of it, totally worth it. I would like to get this hyper-focused perk so I can eventually 
actually get a job because quite honestly, pooping my spleen out of my anus is beginning to get tiring. I'm sick all the time. Please give me this feminine product. Nope. Damn it. I got the stealing upgrade and I'm still so bad. I finally get my clothing. I like how this one says, anything can happen in the night. Many of the men in here look like they've committed countless crimes. And I'm the one that's not supposed to be judgmental. I've been arrested like seven times so far. I got a wristwatch. I do a lot of walking. This will probably be super important. The city has increased funding for waste disposal. There's less scrap on the streets. Nothing like getting kicked in the balls before 6 a.m. Yay, pizza crusts. Ma'am, could you help me? I'm tired of smelling like sourdough bread. Let's scrap on the ground my ass. Yeah, don't mind me, folks. I'm just washing my face in your friggin' water fountain. Thanks for your help. Might as well drink and smoke as well. I think I've done just about everything terrible a child can do at this point. Got food stamps. Still trying to steal your period wear. All right, come on. Big whammy, big whammy, big whammy. I'm like the best thief in the entire world. I break in faster. The, the police can't see me. Come on, Jesus. Yes. Do you even really need it? Yes, I do. For the family I don't have. God damn it! The people in this city cannot be fooled. You can search trash cans twice. This is it. This is finally the ability to go Super Saiyan Hobo. Each trash can is basically a pocket dimension with more trash in it. Oh, it's so good. Every day these people go by you pretending they don't see you in the gutter, but one day they're gonna friggin' pay. All right, we finally got residency. I stayed in the place enough. Oh, I'm not ill anymore. This is the first time ever. I would like to use my library card, please. Reading has taught you something about people skills? Really? <laughs> Arrive at work an hour later, increase job application success rate. Considering how my success blows the entire time I've been playing the game, anything I can do to make it increase is good. Double dipping in trash. All right, we got the begging success rate increase. Gotta use as much as possible. Hello, fellow hobo. I will give you $1. Healthy items restore more hunger or happiness. Yes, please. This is the best day in this game I think I've ever had. We may actually be able to win. I smell like fresh brewed anal sausage, but it's fine. Our success rate has been really good so far. Now there's sausage in the dumpster. Search it twice. Get a support group. Better prices from street vendors. Considering I can never steal from these bastards, I should probably take this. Tenacity significantly increases begging success if your happiness is greater than 90. Considering how much beer I have in my pocket, this is the best possible perk. I got a scratch off ticket and I want absolutely nothing with it. Increased chance of no crime. Yeah, I need it. All right, try and steal a sandwich. Fail as usual. <laughs> Get a premium wash. I fully expected to have an easy life by picking this female character. Do you know what I have found? That I spend all my time on my period. Seriously, double trash cans. Best thing I ever did in my life. That sounds really weird, but it, it, it's true. Get that one last beg in before hitting the uh, the shelter. Slowly making our way up to the magic numbers to get a job. Every day I wake up at the shelter. You gotta check for change. Go study at the library because you dropped out like a dumbass. Then beg for the rest of the day. Open up a bank account. Burglarize a car. Get caught by the police and get arrested. But it makes you hunger full so you can go back and read more books. The city has made welfare cuts resulting in shelters being less effective. Jesus. Your period has started. Oh God, why have you blessed me with never ending periods? Luckily I got tons of booze to get my happiness back up. How come I'm more successful in getting money when I'm drunk than when I'm sober? Welfare cuts my ass. 67 study. We're gonna get the best job we can. I'm tired of eating my own vomit. Burger flipping. It's pleb work. Clearly someone like me who gets arrested all the time, drinks and smokes their life away, disowned their parents, and commits basically every crime possible should be an assistant manager somewhere that has a lot of responsibilities. Come on. 74. Can you help me? I'm the Einstein of the hobo world. Totally worked. The breakfast of champions right outside of the homeless shelter. Today is pizza crusts in the trash. But because our stomach is so iron at this point, I don't get sick anymore. And I get to search from twice. Got a bottle of beer. 82. Pretty soon we'll be ready for the big leagues. Another beer. Wash the clothes. I have severely neglected my begging lately. We're almost out of money. So, um, I didn't know that they did this in the shelters. But, um, I just got cavity checked for contraband. Yeah. All right, bad economy just caused shop prices to increase. That's awesome. Got a book called Idealistic. What? I think it's time to move to another city because at this point we have everything. Oh my God, a car. Got to break into it. And we hit the whammy. Anyway, what I was saying was there's really nothing left here for us. I have eaten so many trash sandwiches at this point. We're going to a new town. What is this? A library next to a library? It's like the Holy Land next to a water fountain next to a shelter. All right, scratch off tickets. I got freaking three of them. We got to win something or not. What? 
one dollar. Might as well finish getting my study all the way up since the libraries are doing the Starbucks thing by building one right next to the other one. This city is way better than the last one. Okay, this is literally the 80th time I've tried to steal these and I failed again. Okay, labor and construction. You know what? I'll take it. One day I'm going to steal something and it's going to work. One day. <laughs> the shelter is fairly empty today because you've eaten most of the other homeless people. These are people who've been chewed and spit out by the world after all. <laughs> it's a fantastic way to word that sentence. Did I get the job? I'm employed! Even though I'm like vomiting all over my employer. Iron stomach. I've gotten like every single thing that you could possibly get to reduce sickness and I'm still sick 90% of the time. You dug out some rock dirt and earned 21. Now we're getting there. Winter has come. You know what else is here? My freaking period! We need 200 before we can finally get elevated to the realm of ultra pleb. However, I will never be able to take care of my friggin' period. I can actually afford stuff now. Hell yeah, give me all this better sleep, rain immunity, increased job success. I've got the smart shirt and the smart tie now. What I lack in life choices, I make up for an incredible power walking skill in a fantastic outfit. Just when things were going good, I got robbed. I just got a raise, which is great considering every night I get a knife held to my throat and get my stuffed up. Increased cash for begging for each malady you have. I should have had this forever ago. <laughs> I finally got the T-Rex rummager thanks to digging through the garbage so often. Going through the trash is illegal now? I can finally buy the thing to take care of my periods. I am now the wealthiest homeless person in the entire city. Sounds like it's time to go to the bar. <laughs> How do they let this little girl in the bar? Oh, nice. I can finally have a litter picker with my litter picker. Copy the effects of your last drink. I can get drunk twice as much. Textbook. You now have residency. Hell yes. Again, because I keep getting kicked out of every city I go to. Reduced happiness decay when starving, which is basically all the time. I'm going to get this though, because maybe I can actually afford to eat now. In the homeless shelter, a young woman just got a job and a house. That means all her homeless stuff is up for grabs. We got a can of Natty Light. I honestly would have preferred to just kill her and use her skin as a costume and live her life instead of mine. Got a cell phone, tie again, fantastic coat, sweet ass pair of socks, kick ass bag, free bus rides, increased steal rate. Damn it, it wasn't Natty Light, it was just a can of spray deodorant. I mean, I guess I'll use it. It's period time, but it doesn't matter because I have the money to stave off its ill effects. A wallet would probably be good too. And fresh underwear. Now I can dig through the trash and not even get docked my hygiene. I'm like a superhuman dumpster diver at this point. I just found two unspoiled meals in the garbage. That is incredible. The shelter has closed down. Whale piss. Hey lady, you still selling that blanket? Oh, I bought it. Never mind. I'm fine. I think I'm going to take this opportunity to try and break into this car right here. Never mind. I'm going to take this opportunity to fall asleep halfway through committing a felony, just like a Florida woman would. As I dab my way into one last dumpster, I can finally begin a new life. Today, I will become the world's first 13-year-old drunken, felonious, Florida-based, homeless real estate agent. Let's do this. Well... Now I can finally fall into the pits of hell. In other words, I get to bust my ass for the man for the rest of my life as he thanklessly crosses his arms and watches me die so that he can become a millionaire. Anyway, folks, hope you enjoyed change. <laughs> Until the next time, stay foxy and much love.